Here we stand, my fellow classmates, with over 17 years of life and 13 years of schooling behind us. Today is a day to be thankful and to be inspired. Thank you very much, Mr. Weaver. And hello, ladies and gentlemen, friends, families, teachers, administration, and most importantly, the Vancouver College Class of 2018. Bear with me as I tell you a little story. In the movie Wonder, a boy with a facial deformity, Augie, is excluded by all his classmates. Everyone stares at him, laughs at him, and calls him names. In 2013, when I came to Vancouver College, I was afraid my experience was going to be similar to his. You see, I was born with profound deafness, meaning I couldn't hear a thing at all. When I came to Vancouver College, I, I, I was like really nervous and the bo I was afraid the boys in my grade were going to treat me awfully because of the things on my ears, which are cochlear implants. And because I was just that weird, short, annoying boy. <laughs> but boy, I was so wrong. And I never thought I would be standing here today as your valedictorian. Thank you to the students and staff at this amazing school who have never treated me like I was any different and have respected me. Vancouver College is truly an incredible and extraordinary school. And thank you all of you seated here this afternoon for giving me this opportunity to speak on this very special occasion. I am deeply honored. We have so many people to be thankful for today. Thank you to President Mr. Nixon, Principal Mr. Bovacqua, and Assistant Principal Mr. Kos uh, Mr. Sorry, Mr. Weaver, and of course Mr. Kozikowski and Mr. Sapelt for working so hard and looking out for us. And of course, thank you to the, all the people that worked behind the scenes to make Vancouver College possible. The Parents Association, the Alumni Association, the Trustees, the Board of Directors, the Advancement Team, the Christian Brothers, Father Minot, and all of the support staff. Thank you. Vancouver College is also home to many talented and dedicated teachers who have taught us a lot. Our teachers might never know how much their guidance has helped all of us, but they should know that they have made a big difference in all, all of our lives, each and every day. Let me just give you a few examples. Mr. Nardi taught us how to do your homework and how to brute force. Mrs. Wicken taught us how to own the dreaded English 12 of Provincial. And Mr. Pineda. Oh, Mr. Pineda. <laughs> Mr. Pineda has taught us how to convert any ordinary apple into a decorative and completely edible apple swan. <laughs> Thank you to each and every teacher for not only teaching us, but to making us better men. While all of the teachers at Vancouver College are so, so important, I think our most important teachers in our lives are our families. To all our parents, grandparents, uncles, aunts, and siblings, I say our success is your success, for you have given us the guidance to excel, the courage to dare, and the belief that we can succeed. So thank you. Indeed, all of the experience and knowledge we gain from teachers and families will no doubt be valuable as we go forward in life. But I think the most important thing we have learned is how God has made all of us to be incredible people. I know that the class of 2018 is truly diverse in every possible way. And that diversity is not a weakness. It is our greatest strength. It's way too easy for us to engage only with people who speak the same language as us, with people who follow the same religion as us, with people who cheer for the same World Cup team as us, and with people who like the same girl as us. <laughs> oh, imagine if there were girls in the school. Yeah. See, with social media changing the way we interact, 
It is so far too easy to engage only with people with whom we already agree. Well, God has made the world to be much bigger than that. God has made you and you and you and you and all of us to be incredible people in His image, to be something, something important. So as I look at the faces of my brothers in the graduating class of 2018, perceptions of individuals are washed away. I no longer see people as they were. I see people as they will be. So, rather than a silly goose, <laughs> or a marshmallow being a bucket of meat, <laughs> failing all of his classes, I see the next Einstein, or perhaps the next blessed Edmund Rice, making a profound impact on the fabric of our future. In fact, some of us have already made remarkable contributions in our community and have changed lives. Firstly, many of us led the encounter retreats, creating life-changing experiences for our grad class, where we became closer to God, ourselves, and our neighbors. We can all agree that encounter has changed lives and brought the boys together to ultimately become better men in a variety of aspects. Furthermore, the class of 2018 was willing to chase their dreams and achieve the impossible. This year, the Students' Council, the Grad Committee, and many of us were outstanding leaders, creating life-changing experiences, wonderful events, and representing our grad class. We organized our first ever TEDx event. We earned ourselves a decent grad lounge. We brought back the senior dance. And we sang happy birthday to Phil every single class. <laughs> I think he's 653 years old or something. I lost track months ago. <laughs> and most importantly, we, re we resurrected Vancouver College Hockey with the VC Saints series. <laughs> and we saw many stunning highlights from all of our high achieving athletes and teams who embraced in the spirit of sportsmanship and demonstrated the class. So thank you to our coaches for supporting us and encouraging us to achieve excellence. And of course, we have also witnessed our dramatic, artistic, and musical talent this year at various displays, musicals, and concerts. Wow. Wow, so thank you. Thank you to the grad class of 2018 for the friendships that we have shared and the memories we have shared together, embracing each other's gifts that God has given us. Through our achievements, it is evident that our grad class will have a profound influence on our younger counterparts and on the future of this world as we leave together as a united whole, as a faith and learning community, as better men. Here we stand, my fellow classmates, as incredible graduates. We face many uncertainties, but we know that in uncertainty lies opportunity and we will embrace those opportunities to make this world an incredible place. Thank you all for coming to witness this very, very special afternoon at Vancouver College. Happy graduation and best of luck to the Vancouver Class College of Class of 2018. God bless Senator Fidelis.